All right, so you're very welcome to my YouTube page. This is Dave Doyle Arts and Photography, and I'm talking about the European uh, elections, the local European elections coming up. I went out with a candidate today, the other day there, to uh, see how canvassing is done out of curiosity uh, for a candidate and came across uh, Peter Dooley. And I know Peter Dooley uh, personally um, from his active, act, being active on the housing issue in Ireland. And I wanted to take to the streets with him to find out what exactly uh, canvassing is and how they do it and what my overall opinion of it was with people before profit. Um, and I invite other people in my local area uh, to get in touch. I'd love to pop around and video you as well and see how you're received or see how people receive you, how you do your thing um, to try and understand the process from different political parties uh, views uh, for their upcoming candidates um i find it very interesting new candidates uh, you know so anyway this is what we did have a look at it uh, and well this is what i did i followed them around essentially it's, it's not rocket science you know uh i'm peter dooley uh the local representative for people before profit in the kimmage Drop mines board uh, I'll be standing in the local elections on May the 24th. I think it's vitally important we need a, mass, a radical change in the local area that will put the needs of people for, uh, first. For too long we've seen the massive crisis we've had in housing, people struggling to get a roof over their head, uh, pay extortionate rents, living uh, families for years and years, and younger people being totally left behind because they can't afford a decent place to live. You saw the health service, you saw the lack of investment in proper use uh, in community facilities. We need to fight and get a radical change for that and it's important to register for everybody in the local area to register to vote and vote for myself and vote for the politics of people before profit re represents which is the, the politics of putting people's needs before the needs of the proper profiteers and developers and landlords uh in the local area we can see Fianna Fáil and Fine Gael if you if you if you don't vote then get those people back in at the end of the day the last thing we want is to see more uh, parties like Fianna Fáil, Fine Gael, who represent the vested interests, who will make it more difficult for working class people and people just starting to get their foot in the ladder to get any sort of decent uh, life in the local community. So we need to fight for that and the radical change is starting with us on May the 24th. So mobilise and vote on the 24th of May and fight for real change. And I want to note that it is your democratic right to vote. People died to create the foundation of this country and you need to be registered to vote and you don't have to be a citizen to vote in the local European elections but you need to vote um, it's very important that you don't spoil your vote uh, that you go down and you cast your uh, vote regardless there's nothing worse than a waste of the vote you know people have died so you could have the right to vote so you know regardless of whether you agree with one political party or one independent or whatever it may be it's, it's your right to vote and people lay their life on the line so you can vote so it's it's really really up to you to vote um, and not be lazy you know i've seen a lot of people asking them like you know, what can what are you going to do for me what's he going what are you going to do for the community it should really be the response that you have when you're uh, asking a politician or potential candidate coming to your door what are you doing for the community uh, that's my opinion. But um, yeah, very interesting. And, uh, that's that. Now, I, I don't realistically want this this to become like a, a political uh, debate type thing. It's just like I like video uh, production and stuff like that. And so I thought I'd go with this topic now. I gotta tell you, I find it very tough in front of a camera trying to think of topics and, 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 and things to do to develop my own personal channel in relation to uh, photography and art and um, you know it's it's a struggle putting the camera on yourself as opposed to on other people uh, that's very easy um, I don't know where I'm going with this channel I don't know what exactly I'm doing where my foresight is I'm just picking it up and going and so you can see what I'm shooting on. I'm shooting on a, a, a Samsung S9 phone here, I'm using Filmic Pro. Okay, I have I'm shooting in C-Log, 
which is for colour grading at a later stage. I'm using a tripod to hold it up and I'm also using for audio because this app is fantastic it lets you monitor the audio uh, in audio if you have a microphone uh, and I've got a uh, I've got a mic it's going to come to me now Rode video mic me I have here and um, let's just have a look at it here so you can see let's just have a look here so we can see what it is did I catch you there yeah video mic me and you can see it monitoring the levels and yeah, pretty much so. It's obviously just on a tripod. Now, what am I that? I might add it's on a Mickey Mouse tripod. Now, this tripod I bought about 30 years ago. I bought it in Argos, and it's a fantastic little thing to do. Um, not everyone has like big, book, big books uh, to be doing their thing, um, but I find that it is a sturdy, reliable device for myself uh, when I'm using the phone for video. And, um, so, there you go. I just wanted to share which of what I'm using in this particular video uh, issue, uh, for this YouTube video. So, in an attempt to take this forward, I would like um, to, you know, like you to like the channel and give it a up. And uh, you have a comment, stick it below because I love comments, you know. Yeah, thanks a million for watching.